Hey, Dave Sports Cards here. Back with uh, part two of my shopping trip from the other day. Um, gonna do a recap on the 2005 Tops updates and highlights baseball. Show you what I got. Um, going into this, uh, I didn't know you were guaranteed any um, game used or anything. Um, turns out. Overall, game used uh, an autograph are one every 16 packs. There's 36 packs in here, so um, I should have gotten two hits. I didn't. I only got uh, one hit, but overall, it was a really nice box break, and uh, it was only 35 bucks. So um, yeah, you're getting 36 packs for 35 bucks. That's less than a dollar a pack. So you really can't beat that. It's a 330 card set. Uh, you're getting 360 cards per box because there's 10 cards per pack. Um, minus the inserts and the seven doubles I got, I am three cards away from the uh, complete update set. Um, just three, you know, cheapy cards, like 10 sun cards. So next time I'm out. Uh, at that card shop, and we'll see if he's got them. He's got a ton of stuff there. Or I'll just, I don't know, look them up online. But, um, out of the box, I did get, um, nine gold cards, or one every four, so I got nine. So I did good on those. Got a Scott, uh, Schoenweiss, Schoenweiss, something like that. Uh, Marlon Anderson. Uh, Claudio Vargas, Placido Polanco, Tigers card, nice. Local team, very cool. Um, Alex Sanchez, and then I got a postseason highlights, um, gold. Never gotten any of the uh, subset base cards, gold before, so that was a first. Um, and then I got a Sporting News Jason Jambi gold, so that was really cool. Uh, Mark Teixeira, home run derby. And a Andy Santana. First year gold. Then I got a bunch of these um, home run history Barry Bonds. Um, basically, there's one card for every home run he hit. Tells you a little bit about the home run, uh, what game it was, uh, where it was at, inning, probably see all that, how many men on base, outs. Um, so it's pretty cool, but I think there's like 600 and, 662 cards to, to the set, so. Yeah, not something I'll be chasing after. Um, and then this is pretty cool. Um, inaugural lineup, Washington Nationals. Um, they got one player for every, or one card for every um, player on the lineup. Um, so that was pretty cool. I got four of those. Um, I got Nick Johnson, Jose Vidro, uh, uh, Jose Guillen, and a Christian Guzman. So uh, that was pretty cool. Uh, like I said, only three cards short of the complete set, and that was just for one box. Um, and then the jersey card I got uh, was a All-Star Stitches Felipe Lopez uh, All-Star uh, Workout Jersey um, worn during the All-Star game. Really cool. Um, orange uh, swatch. Better than white, better than gray. Um, never had an orange swatch before, so that's really cool. Um, there you can see it. Really cool. So not a bad box. Um, I mean, for the price, 35 bucks for 36 packs, 10 cards per pack. Um, that is, that's definitely a, a great deal. Um, bit of a bummer. I didn't get a second hit, but uh, when I bought it going into this, I didn't even know I was going to get a single hit. So I'm, I'm happy I at least got one. Pretty nice cards. But uh, yeah, thanks for watching and uh, stay tuned for more. I still got to do a recap on the Fleer Ultra. And actually, in my first video, I forgot to mention that I found a box of, I can't find the box, of 2010 uh, Series 1 Upper Deck Baseball uh, Blaster Box at Target for $11.99 um, value box. So that was pretty cool, but I'll do a recap on those two boxes. So stay tuned for those videos, guys. Thanks for watching.